and we are here today to honor Staff Sergeant Howard Reed and present his family with his posthumous military service medals. A World War II soldier killed in battle finally receiving recognition today for his heroic actions. Staff Sergeant Howard Reed was killed in 1944. At Historic Locust Grove today, Alexis Jones and photojournalist Jessica Farley talked with his grandson, who was honoring his legacy. More than 400,000 U.S. soldiers didn't make it home from World War II, leaving behind their loved ones. And now today, 79 years later, one family finally received some closure. It's an honor long overdue. <laughs> Decades after a World War II battle in France, Staff Sergeant Howard Reed was awarded several medals, including a Bronze Star. You've seen it on license plates and it's uh, the most significant. U.S. Senator Rand Paul presented the medals to the late veteran's grandson, Councilman Scott Reed. Monday, Reed shared some of his grandfather's last words, written in a letter to his father. If I don't come to you, back home to you and your mother, just remember one thing, that is your daddy loved his little family more than life. Sergeant Reed died from battle wounds soon after in 1944. He was just a 23-year-old who volunteered to be on the front lines. I could have stayed home and let the other men of this great nation do all the work, but as I saw it, it was my duty as a good American to get into this battle of nations. He was about country first, self second. A value the veteran hoped would be passed down through generations. While Councilman Reed never got the chance to meet his grandfather, he says Monday's ceremony brought his family more than just honor. It gave them healing. In Louisville, Alexis Jones, WHAS 11 on your side.